quite strong. Um, so his size presents some problems. Uh, and Douglas is another guy that's really a good football player. And then they do a good job getting the ball to their backs too. They're, they've got three backs. You know, the one guy's more of a runner, but the other two guys are very good in the passing game. And we saw uh, last year firsthand how explosive Grigsby is. You know, he can really, you let him loose, boy, he can be bad to quick. You know, he's really, he's a good player. Was there a key to slowing Grigsby down last year? <laughs> well, you know, it's easier said than done. I mean, everybody's got to be in the right spot, and you just you can't let him get started. Uh, I didn't say this publicly last year; it wouldn't have been appropriate, but I'll say it now. I was hoping he'd come out in the draft uh, after our game. You know, so I was kind of made a mental note of that one. Didn't happen, so now we get to see him again. And uh, he's just—he's really—he's a good football player, very diverse. You said they changed their offense around after, with with the emergence of full, yeah. Foles. Yeah. Mm -hmm. How how? Yeah, you know, last year we were more concerned about the run uh, from the quarterback position. You know, them the right. threat of the run and and, uh, and and Foles. Not that he can't run, but he's not looking to run. He's looking to throw the football and does it very well. You know, so he does a good job of getting the ball to different spots on the field and different players. And, uh, and they've got guys that really can do something with it. So they've got a very you know very experienced offensive line. They're a big, strong group and very uh, very productive. How do you adjust or do you adjust practice this week to prepare for a night game?